Go ahead. I want to ask you about infrastructure in a second and some other news on COVID and Delta right now. Governor DeSantis in Florida, as you know, is now threatening to withhold salaries of school board members and superintendents in districts that do not comply with his order outlawing, outlawing mask mandates at schools. What's the White House's take on that? Well, I do want to call out um, the uh, the courage and the uh, boldness of a number of leaders in Florida, including in Miami-Dade County, people who are stepping up uh, to do the right thing to protect students and keep schools safe and open. We are continuing to look for ways uh, to go back to your question, Peter, to for the U.S. government to support districts and schools uh, as they try to follow the science, do the right thing, and save lives. I would note what is publicly available and knowable is that the American Rescue Plan funds that were distributed to Florida to provide assistance to schools have not yet been distributed from the state level. So the question is, why not? Uh, and those can be used uh, to cover expenses that come up in this period of time. They're federal funds, uh, and they are at, not under, they're under federal discretion. So they just need to be distributed to these schools. We're looking into what's possible. So in simple terms, what, is the, what do you say directly to Governor DeSantis about this, about this threatened punishment? Well, we, we would say what we've said from the beginning, Peter, which is that um, if you're not interested in uh, following the public health guidelines to protect the lives of people in your state, to give parents uh, some comfort as they're sending their kids to school, schools are opening uh, in Florida this week, I know, in many parts of Florida, then get out of the way and let uh, public officials, let local officials do their job to keep students safe. Um, this is serious, and we're talking about people's lives, and we know based on public health guidelines that even though kids under a certain age are not yet eligible, uh, masks can have a, a huge impact. A couple follow-ups on the Cuomo news 